This is uh, hello there. This is Lord Potato, and um, it's just Potato. Uh, this is uh, what if Naruto had modern slash path slash future weapons and was neglected. Um. So, part one was pretty freaking short. I didn't have time to do anything. Uh, death is gonna be part two. And, where was I? Did I left off? Oh, yeah. I have a very short time memory. Um, this is where Naruto's gonna go back to the academy. He does have a house. He actually made his house bigger. How? Well, since he unlocked the uh the uh unlocked the powers of uh summoning and desummoning and, and using different weapons and all that. He has multiple different weapons. Let me damn I should have made a list, but he got multiple like think of any gun from future uh well we don't actually understand anything from future, but think of laser guns. Um Think of modern weapons that we have right now. Any sniper rifles, shotguns, uh, AK, pistol, Glock. Oh, wait, Glock and pistol are the same thing. Pistols, melee weapons. He can he he can basically summon a melee weapon. I don't know. Just think of a bat, machete, brass knuckles. Yes, yeah, so I'm giving him brass knuckles. Like when he increases his chakra into his fist and just summons the brass knuckles, I'm making him knock the shit out of Sunite. Um. Uh, what's it called? Uh, also, he can. It's summoning. You know how when they do summoning things, they summon some kind of animal or anything. Well, Naruto is gonna summon something. He can summon any vehicle, like any vehicle weapon. Like tanks, helicopter, airplane, just jet its way out. Uh, motorcycle, he can modify his motorcycle to have weapons. Car vehicles, yeah, cars and all that. Uh, yeah. Also, he has the minds of uh, how he can learn all how to do all these things. He has the minds of uh, different, like, re not reincarnations, but like one reincarnation person. And that reincarnation person was, like, someone that learned, like, a lot of things. He's not anything special, but he, like, knows how to use a bunch of weapons. Like, some kind of military person. Yeah, that's what I'm kind of thinking. Or he just has the mind of a different world. Um. To cut. So, Naruto has a house. Knows how to survive. Knows how to hunt. Yes. When he hunts, he has a... A suppressor sniper rifle so he doesn't make loud noise or well he doesn't have a suppressor sniper rifle. he has a crossbow that's also a weapon yeah, crossbow bow he can summon weapons da, 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 da. Uh, hatchets and other things tomahawks uh, uh, think of like from a uh, call of duty of zombie warfare uh, think of ray gun oh, shit. Think of ray gun, uh, pack a punch. He, he can just like I don't know, like focus a lot of energy to one gun and turns into a pack a punch gun. Yes, make him overpower the power. Well, he's not gonna get the pack a punch until he's in Shonen Jump with the nuke. I'm not letting him have a nuke unless he gets 15 kills in a row and have the nuke release. Nuke inbound. Um, what's it got? Uh, so he knows how to hunt, uh, grow, also train, read, uh, and other things. So he goes back to the academy, and there's Menma, uh, Narui, and uh, also I forgot to say this, but Naruto does have his hair black. It's not no more just blonde hair. It's a uh, black, and he does unlock his shotgun. gun. He did look, and he said, "Doesn't he? He has read about uh, the shotgun, gun, and his eyes are red. He also unlocked into three tomoe. Yes, 
I'm giving him the three to me. His minor can shot gun's gonna be kinda like I don't know. I don't know what to put money gun shot I'm probably gonna draw it. Just think of some some kind of original design. Uh he's he went to school, his hair is black, so no one actually saw that it was probably Naruto. Uh except for the whiskers. But uh Naruto decided to get rid of the whiskers for some he just said, Why the hell do I have this? And he just just cuss like shaved them off. Because I feel like their hair is not like those whiskers, yeah. So he shapes them off and just says, ah, that's better. Or, are they? You know what, never mind. Uh, he he wasn't born with whiskers, so yeah. That was Menma and Mini, Mini, Nari, Nari. So, uh, they, they don't know it's Naruto because the blonde hair and, um, yeah. So they just didn't look at him and everyone was like, everyone's laughing because Naruto isn't here and it's a graduation today. I'm, uh, yeah, let's keep going. Uh, so Aruka came in and told everyone to sit down and, um, and he started, uh, calling names like, Medma, this, that, Chiha, Sasuke, uh, Sasuke are useless. And then he said Naruto Uzumaki. And Naruto did stand up and raise his hand. Bef well, not raise his hand. Sasuke said something before that. He said, wow, that loser isn't here. How? Huh? You think he already died from the villagers or something? Or do you think he died from a pack of wolves or something? And Naruto stand up and said, here. And everyone turned around, and it's Naruto but with black hair, black eyes, death glare, ready to fuck shit up. <laughs> so, Aruka said, okay. Aruka and Naruto does not have the same relationship in canon. Uh, uh, Aruka doesn't hate Naruto. He he doesn't, like, hate him because, A, the Ninetales, uh... Since he does have the nine toes, but he just thought of it. Wait, if he had the nine toes, wouldn't he already destroy the village? So Aruka is smart in this one, so he doesn't hate Naruto. I'm making him not hate him. Also, Ichigo Ramen uh doesn't hate Naruto. He just doesn't talk to him because he doesn't want to get attacked by the Ambus that uh sort of uh protect not protects but just looks at the Naruto sort of. They barely do it. They didn't do it for the like four years time skip. Um and so Aruka said, Okay. And then Menma said, Oh, you're back, you demon. Wait, why is your hair black? And Naruto not giving a shit. Because if Menma ever like pisses him off just a just a lot, uh Naruto is not having enough of this bullshit and just shooting him in the fucking face. So everyone takes the test. Naruto, seeing this, his test is Genjutsu. He doesn't say anything. Instead, he just looks at it and just scribbles some random words. Even how he's smart enough to like, even if it's a Genjutsu high ranking test or something, Naruto's smart enough to just pass it awesome. But he doesn't care. He just like screws scrabble. Also, uh, Shikamaru, Choji, and Kiba. Kiba still calls Naruto a demon. Uh, Choji, uh, doesn't really care about Naruto. He doesn't, like, hate him or anything. And uh, Shikamaru, I'm gonna make Shikamaru be, like, cool, cool with Naruto. Like, yeah, okay. Like, so, yeah. Everyone else is still a prick. In my water. Uh, so, um, Naruto, and then it's time for the... The freaking physical thrower throwing shurikens. Of course, Naruto training how to use shurikens doesn't give a shit. Uh, he wants to just pull out his gun and start shooting the targets. Some kind of god. Um, and then, uh, what's Ka? He just throws them, miss almost all of them. Only gets one. That's because they were all just blunts. They couldn't stick to anything. So, um, he just threw it. Hard enough so I can stick. 
and Miski Miski what the f f I'm gonna search up his name. I call keep calling him Miski. So Miski um decides to um well he does tell what well, no wait. So Mizuki was the one that was trying to fail Naruto. Naruto noticing these uh just doesn't care. He does manage to stick one in and done. And the whole uh, f uh the whole fight with like Naruto versus Sasuke still is gonna happen, but Naruto on this time he doesn't actually show any moves. Instead, he just sits there and just waits for Sasuke just to punch him, or well, not punch him. He just forfeits. And Sasuke was like, okay, freaking loser. Because Sasuke and Naruto does not have the same relationship since uh, Sasuke is the reincarnation Indera, but uh, Naruto is not. Naruto does not have Indera, not Indera, Ashura inside him. So, um, yeah. But he, he doesn't have the anime plot twist, but my anime plot twist. It's always gonna be this. No, I'm just kidding. It's just I'm trying to make this. Um. So Naruto doesn't care about fighting. He fails. Yes, he already knows this. Um. But Mizuki does come to him before he left the village back to his house in the forest. Mizuki does tell him, "Hey kid, uh, you know, hey Naruto, you know you can uh, go get the scroll ceiling and um." Uh, do this and that. The same thing, thing happens in canon. Except for Naruto. Knowing this is a trap. But still goes gets it. Because he's not dumb. He just wants to scroll ceiling. So he can just copy all the juices in it. Yeah. So Naruto does go. The ninjas that were at front. Were both just shot to death. Because he just decides to grab his silencer. And shoot both of them. And then grab the scroll ceiling. Well not. Let's not say he doesn't shoot both of them. He just stabs both of them with knives. Not the coup knives. They're just two knives. Two regular knives. He just slashed both of them. He goes through. He grabs the scroll ceiling. And then he uses his shotting gun just to read all of it. And then it only takes him like 30 minutes. He reads all of it. Cops all of it. And then uh, Ruka came out of nowhere and said, Naruto, what are you doing? And uh, Naruto said, oh, uh, Ruka, um, I thought I had to steal the scroll ceiling so I can get my headband. And Aruka thinking, well, uh, he said, Mizuki told me to go grab it. And Mizuki still does that whole, uh, throws that sh big ass shotting gun, or not shotting gun, shuriken, at, um, at, uh, Uruka, or at Naruto. But Aruka still protects it, and Naruto saying, what? He was like, why do you protect me, Aruka? And Aruka said, Nar Naruto. And Mizuki just said, ha 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 ha, Naruto, do you know why the villagers hate you? Uh, is it because I don't have the Nine Tails? And Mizuki and Aruka hearing this, they're like, what? Yeah, Naruto already knows that he doesn't have the Nine Tails. He's like, I don't have the Nine Tails. Narui and Minna has the Nine Tails split in half. Because she knows he has like, that, that like percentage and it's already gone. And also... Why do you even hate me if I don't have a nine tails? And Mizuki just uh what? <laughs> Aruka, huh? So yeah, Naruto just said, oh well. Uh, right now, I really don't care. I really just gonna go back to sleep or become a rogue or something. Uh, so I don't care no more. He literally just pulls out his gun, or my, let's just say he pulls out a freaking. M14 and just says, okay, uh, goodbye, uh, Mizuki. Mizuki saying, what the hell is that? Pa 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 pa. So start shooting and two bullets. Since this this is a burst gun and not an auto gun or a single shot gun, this is a burst gun. So a shot, two bullets in one of his legs. So Mizuki could not jump. He he had it. He just said, what the hell? Why? What is that? And uh, Ruka seeing for the first time this M14 or yeah, I'm just calling it M14. Um, just seeing this uh, Naruto just shooting at him. The bullets are going through the tree that was at Mizuki standing by, and one of the bullets gets through and hits Mizuki and like one of the lungs. 
Mizuki starts coughing blood. <laughs> what the hell? Naruto jumps on the tree and starts walking up the tree because he knows how to use chakra control. Aruka amazed of this, but also scared on what the hell that is. And then he just starts running and uh, he got to Mizuki and said to use for surrender. And Mizuki saying, what the hell is that? Naruto said, if you don't surrender, I'm going to shoot both your legs and your arm and make sure you don't fucking walk or fucking decide to use a jutsu. Mizuki about to use a jutsu and uh, Naruto not letting that happen, he shot one of shot his right arm, which can't he can't use a one hand sign jutsu because uh, only person that can use it are like professionals, real professional jutsu, like Sasuke, older Sasuke, not new, not like Kid Sasuke. Kid Sasuke is a bitch. So yeah, um, Mizuki can't use his jutsu, but he was also going to try to jump and kick Naruto until Naruto grabs his knife and just slashes at Mizuki's leg. Well, Mizuki was just like, what the hell is that? That's not a ku knife. It looks like a goddamn kitchen knife, which Naruto pulls it, uh, shows it's not even a kitchen knife. He just says, what the hell? And Naruto switches, uh, decides to despawn the knife into a brass knuckles. These uh, brass knuckles are golden brass knuckles, which punches the shit out of Mizuki in the face and knocks the shit out of him. While Aruka's amazed and then says, Naruto, that was amazing. And Naruto said, yeah, thank you. Um, uh, Aruka said, so do you want to become a ninja? And I just said, not really. I was thinking of becoming a ninja, but I'm thinking of just going rogue. Since this village hates me. And Aruka hearing these words, going rogue? Yes, I'm making Naruto go rogue instead of... Well, not go rogue. He said, yeah, I'll become a ninja. So he still becomes a ninja, canon and all that. The teams he's in, he's actually... And, um... And a team was, let's say, uh, um, Donzo, well, let's say, uh, Donzo was actually watching this, and Donzo wasn't uh, gonna attack, uh, Mizuki yet, until his Anbu, his root Anbu were about to jump in at Mizuki and Naruto, but then, like, I'm gonna just say one thing, um, uh, what's it called, uh, Donzo does not hate Naruto. He knows he doesn't have the nine tails, so there's no point in just attacking him. Instead, when he defeated Mizuki, uh, um, uh, Donzo came behind him and then said, "So Naruto, we like to become a ninja, but in my team." And Naruto, when he was walking back to his house, uh, Donzo came up behind him and says. How much do you hate this village? And Naruto said, a lot. Why so? He's like, I see. Since Donzo doesn't, like, doesn't, he does think the village is still needs weapons. But he doesn't like how uh, Minto is doing it. He's like, you should treat those goddamn demon foxes like weapons. Like, yeah. So, I'm going to say Donzo is actually going to become a Joni Sensei. And he said he picked Naruto and um, two other people that I'm gonna make make up. Uh... Actually, no, no, no. I'm uh instead I'm gonna go back. Uh, he, he still gets Kakashi on his team and all that. So Naruto goes in and says, "Team Aruka still does the teams, but Team Eleven. It's gonna be Team Eleven. That's Kushina and Minna and Minato. Not Minato." Narwi and someone else. Uh, let's just make some uh, uh, some random random character that's probably gonna die to Gara. I'm just gonna make it. So I don't need to remember him. Wait, let me just do something. Okay, I'm back. Also, if you heard like I don't know, like a machine turn on like a while ago, that's just because of my heater. It kind of got hot in here, so I turned it off. 
Um, what's it called? So yeah, team eleven is that. Um, team seven is Naruto. The same thing happens, just like Sasuke, and yeah. Uh, all teams are gone, and everyone. Naruto is still sitting at the back because he doesn't want any need anything to do with Sasuke or Sasuke. Sasuke angry because he doesn't want Naruto on his team. He'd rather have Mema or Narui. And Kakashi's still pretty late for a while. And what kind of thing? Oh, shoot. gotta hurry. So Naruto, not Naruto. Kakashi gets there after like two hours. Kakashi tells him to go up the roof. Naruto body flickers because yeah, I'm giving him that also. He just body flickers it up there, and then Kakashi got there and sees Naruto. And Naruto just chilling up there. Just chilling, he doesn't care. Uh, Kakashi wondering how the heck they got here. Oh well. And uh, Sasuke and Sasuke got up there. Sasuke kind of gets angry at how Naruto did that. So the same thing happens to whole uh, Sasuke. I don't really care about her goals because I never ever care about her goals. They're stupid as hell. Sasuke is the same goal, trying to kill Itachi, because Itachi did kill the clan. Uh, what's it called? What is it next? Also, um, then as uh, well, Kakashi does his goals also, but they're just like none of your business and all that. And then it's Naruto. Na he, Nar uh, Kakashi points at Naruto. Naruto just looks at him and just says, "My name is Naruto." Uh, think of some random. Name, uh, um, my name is Naruto H. D. Brian, and uh, which shocks Kakashi because he just said, I thought it was Sumaki. No, it's not because Naruto's changing it to some random name. Oh, wait, he changes his full name, he doesn't say Naruto, like he says, My name is John. Will, Will, William, and, uh, Kakashi was like, uh, what? <laughs> yes, this is gonna be John, or, well, I'm gonna keep calling, you know what, screw it, it's just gonna be Naruto, uh, just doesn't have a last name or another last name, so I say Naruto, uh, my, my goals, I have no goals, my, my dreams, uh, probably burnt the whole world, uh, Say something in his mind. I, none of, I don't know. None of your business. My likes. Training. Not trying to get stronger. My dislikes. I hate everything. <laughs> he just says it with the most. Just annoyed voice. I hate everything. Anything that lives. I want to burn it down. Which Kakashi's like. God damn. This boy is more emo than goddamn Sasuke. You see the Ichihas are more emo. Why is this kid more emo than them? And Kakashi said, oh, okay. Naruto, uh, Kakashi doesn't hate Naruto on this one. Uh, well, what the one? This. Kakashi never hated Naruto. Instead, Kakashi doesn't, like, like Naruto, but doesn't hate him. So, Kakashi was like, okay, everyone come tomorrow to the bell test and all that. Don't eat and all that. Naruto, uh, let's just skip that. Naruto doesn't care. He still eats. Uh, gets there and with the full stomach and all that. Not that full. Um, Kakashi takes forever. Time to skip. Uh, Kakashi's now there and he tells about the bell test, the two bells there, and then he says, "Okay, start." Because I feel like if you didn't click on this what if and you don't know anything about Naruto, uh, too bad. I'm not gonna explain half of them. Uh, so. Naruto gets there, like he. Well, Naruto doesn't get there. Naruto is there, and Kakashi is wondering why is this kid not just there? He's just like, what? Just standing there. And then uh, Kakashi said, uh, "Naruto, you aren't aren't you like going with in the forest to hide or something?" Naruto said, "Oh, this is what it's about. I see." Then he said, "Okay." He goes long distance, very long distance. Like you can still see him. There's like a 
view and all that. And Kakashi is wondering, why is he all the way over there? I can still see him. Naruto decides to pull out a sniper rifle. And sees Kakashi. And Kakashi says, what the hell is that? And where the hell did he pull that out from? <coughs> you just hear this. Shoom. And Kakashi gets... Uh, it's a silencer, so it does reduce the loud noise. And it... Kakashi was like, what? You shot the leg like, what the fuck? What the hell? Oh, what? Where the hell did I just get hit by? Was that Naruto? Uh, Sasuke and Sasuke are seeing this loud noise from Naruto was like, huh, do you think I hit him? He then screams out because he just pulled out like a... He then just uh, amplifies his voice with Chakra and says, Hey, Kakashi, did I hit you? Kakashi's like, what the, what the fuck did you hit me with? Oh, I see, you did get hit. So he takes, he decides to despawn the sniper rifle and pulls out an RPG and he just says, okay. Uh, wait, I can't say that. He just, just shoots the RPG. Pew! And it... Then Kakashi tries to dodge what it dodged and it hits one of the trees and goes, kaboom! Kakashi's like, what the? And Sasuke and Sasuke are like, what the hell is going on? Naruto, not caring no more, decides to run at Kakashi with like his knife and brass knuckles and ready to fight Kakashi. Kakashi, seeing this, uh, sees the knife but doesn't see the brass knuckles because Naruto still hasn't spawned it in. So Naruto decides to, uh, wait, not Naruto, uh, 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 uh wait, wait, I'm gonna come back. You know what, I'm just gonna say this fast pace because I gotta go somewhere. And, uh, so Naruto does beat the shit of Kakashi, goes up there, uh, melee, hey, melee's, uh, melee's, uh, Kakashi, he punches the shit out of Kakashi, uh, with the brass knuckles, and then Kakashi was like, what the fuck? He just felt the pain, he was like, what the fuck was that? He starts getting his ass handed to him by, uh, Naruto. Naruto is beating the shit of Kakashi, and Kakashi can't do anything. And Kakashi was about to like substitute Jutsu away, but Naruto pulls out his pistol and just shoots him in the arm, making sure that Kakashi can't uh, substitute Jutsu away. While while Kakashi feeling the pain and all that. Oh uh, wait. Okay, while Kakashi feeling the pain by getting shot in his right arm, or should have said left arm. He got shot in the left arm and can't use his left arm because Naruto shot the shit out of it. Um. He shot like two bullets into his arm, so Kakashi can't use his uh, left arm right now because Naruto just shot the shit out of it. And so, after that happened, uh, Kakashi was like, What the hell is this kid? Then gets punched again, the shit of with brass knuckles. Also, this time it's diamond brass knuckles. Yes, he, he changed his brass knuckles to have like some diamond tips on it. So he punched the shit out of Kakashi. Also, I'm gonna come back. Okay, I'm back. So while Naruto just punches the shit out of Kakashi, Kakashi was like, God damn, this kid is so strong. Yes, he's using chakra with the brass knuckles and just punching the shit out of Kakashi. Kakashi's like, why isn't the kid just taking the bells already to keep beating my ass? And Sasuke does go just to take the bells for himself. But Naruto, not well, Naruto does let him take the bells. And then Naruto, Sasuke gives one to Sasuke, and Naruto said, so is that teamwork enough for you, Kakashi? Kakashi said, uh, well, since you've been beating the shit of me, I don't know. I mean, they both took the bell, so I guess that is teamwork. I guess so, god damn, you punch like a fucking, you fucking log. Eh, he can't say truck, but yeah. So... Naruto said, okay, so I, now I can go home, right? He's like, uh, what, you said this, this, yes, I knew this whole time it's about teamwork, so I just start being the shadow and waiting for Sasuke just to take the bells. And since this was no teamwork accordingly or anything, it's better to just tell you that, yeah, it's teamwork. Close enough, fuck off, leave me alone. Naruto goes back home and just, like, says, if you heard that, it's just a car, I have to go somewhere. And I'm outside, and I forgot to get something. So Naruto does beat the shit out of 
Kakashi, Kakashi can't. Well, Kakashi then said, wait up, Naruto. And Naruto said, uh, fuck no, I have to do something. And uh, Naruto just decides to leave and body flickers away. Easy. Um, her Kakashi can't do it. Couldn't even get up because Naruto just shot him in the leg with a goddamn sniper rifle. And then shot both, uh, shot him twice in the left arm. And so Naruto goes back home. This is where I'm going to leave it off and uh, say goodbye. Probably tonight I'm going to make another one. Jesus Christ, I don't have time to do anything that much. So, good luck. Uh, when I, good luck. I said goodbye. Good night. Good day. And... Have a fantastic potato day. Let me just make that mean.